Hey y'all, I'm Rhonda and welcome back to my kitchen. Um, today I am going to be making a blueberry poke cake. Now uh, Russell says he ain't never heard of this before, but um, this cake has been, uh, we have really enjoyed it in our family. It is delicious. So I'm going to just whip it up real quick. Um, my daughter is coming tomorrow. I always ask them, what you want to eat? What you want to eat? So, um, told her I was going to make this little cake for her. So, um, my mama does the same thing to us whenever uh, she hears that we're coming. She always says, what you want? What you want? We're the same women that told our children, uh, eat it or leave it. <laughs> mm -hmm. But here we are. What you want, baby? What can mama fix you? So, I'm going to whip up this little cake so it'll be good and chilled and ready tomorrow when uh, after we eat. But um, this cake starts with just a regular cake mix. Now this, um, I just have a classic white cake. Um, you can use whatever cake you want. I actually like lemon because y'all know, listen, them blueberries and lemon, it works real good together. So, I am going to start with... Um, my eggs, I have three eggs. Now, if I really wanted this to just be a white cake mix, I would just use my egg yolks. But um, I'm putting the whole eggs in there. I've got three big old country chicken eggs in there. Thank you, EJ. I'll just get this out of the way here. I've got a half a cup of vegetable oil and one cup of just water. And I'm gonna give that just a little zip zip and um, then I'm going to add my cake mix in here. Now, I always add a little extra something. And um, I put just a little bit of sour cream and about a half cup of sugar. Now, it used to be that these boxes had a whole lot more in it. Now, they skimp on us. So, um, uh, the recipe is different from what I used to do. But we could just play it by ear. But let me go ahead and get this mixed up. Got stuff everywhere here. Give this a little zip. She sounds like she's about to die, but it's not. All right, we got this ready to go in here. Get old white cake mix. All right, and uh, I'm gonna add, um, this is about a half cup of sugar in it. And I'm gonna put just a little bit of sour cream, maybe a couple tablespoons in here. You do not have to do this. This is just, um, this makes, oh, I thought it fell. This just makes it really moist. I'm probably gonna put just about a half a cup in there, same, match it. And um, give this a little, little stir. Of course, I'm gonna add a little uh, vanilla flavoring in here, and I'm not gonna measure, but maybe about a tablespoon for y'all that measure. Um, lemon flavoring is good in this because once again that lemon and blueberry it just really listen they're like BFFs they go really good together all right mix this in she sounds like she's about to die all right I'm just gonna set it there okay y'all I have got of course my pan is uh, greased and floured old school you can use the whatever you want in yours the joy cooking spray but uh this is what we're using get this out of here before i throw it every which way and just that quick we got our cake ready to go in the oven i hope they hadn't skimped us so bad that it uh makes half a cake it makes half a cake we'll just have a little like a little pancake in there i probably should have just doubled it but i didn't Let's just hope she rises well. <laughs> I'm getting everything out of this too, I'm telling you. All right. Okay, I'm gonna give it a little mix around and I... All right, I'm gonna put this in the oven. I have it set at 350 degrees, raring to go. And um, I'm gonna check this in about 25 minutes and see where we're at. Everybody's uh, oven cooks differently um, and then I'll be back to make that blueberry sauce 
All right, y'all, I'm going to show y'all how to just make an easy little blueberry pie filling. Now, you can, of course, skip this step altogether. Just buy yourself some pie filling in the store. But um, I've got these fresh blueberries, and we're going to use them. All right, I'm going to start with a little bit of water, and I am going to um, measure. So I've got uh, two tablespoons of water. I'm going to put my... Uh, about a teaspoon or so of of um, cornstarch in there. I'm gonna dump my blueberries in here. Start swirling them around. And I've got a half a cup of sugar. Now I'm not gonna use that much sugar. I am going to um, probably put about six tablespoons. You know what? I'm gonna do about a half. Here we go. We want this good and sweet and tasty. I haven't used quite all of this half cup. I'm, of course, going to add just a little bit of vanilla flavoring in here. And we just want this to cook until these blueberries start popping. And this sauce is going to mix up. I might add a little bit more water with that cornstarch there. Yummy! Smells good. It does, don't it? Mm -hmm. it? Smells delicious. And this part doesn't take too long. Now my cake is in the oven, and I wanted to go ahead and get this done so that it can kind of cool off just a little bit. Because we're going to be putting um, a pudding mixture um, on this as well. Before we put these blueberries on there. So I want it to be nice and cool. Alright, I'm just going to let it uh, simmer here just for a minute until they start popping. And this sauce is going to thicken up. It's going to be just like um, opening up a can of pie filling. Except you will have fresh stuff and it's just delicious. Alright y'all, it's only been a few minutes. This does not take long. Look at that beautiful blueberry sauce there. Mm -hmm. See how it's thickened mm -hmm. up? You can put your little finger there and doesn't anything doesn't run. So, these are ready. So, I'm just going to let these little suckers cool and um, wait on my cake. To finish baking, and um, then we're gonna mix up that cream cheese uh, frosting, and I've got a filling. Woo! There she is, y'all. It did rise up, thankfully. And um, while it is hot, I'm gonna start um, making my little holes. Now, you just get something with a round end. Um, this is uh, Old Disney Methuselah. A Kool-Aid spoon, if that tells you anything. And I'm just going to make some little holes in here like this. You can uh, do as many as you want. This is what I'm going to do. Just a bop, bop, bop. Really no rhyme or reason. Just just holes. Because what we're going to do is um, I've got this uh, box of uh, cheesecake instant mix. We're going to um, mix that with some milk. We're going to cover this, and I'm, I'm going to put it in the refrigerator for about 10 minutes, and then I'll mix up my um, cream cheese icing. I'm just going to make these little holes. Bop, bop, bop. Ain't got to be nothing that's fancy. Where, that's where your poke cake comes this from? This is where your poke cake comes from. Oh, okay. you, poke, you poke the hole so all this little goodness gets a hole in them holes and just uh, gets real happy. Mm. Well, let me ask you a question since this is for tomorrow. Okay. Do I get to do my part in this video? Or and I taste wait it? Till tomorrow? And yeah, taste, taste it? it. Oh, yeah. We're going to taste it, honey. Oh, yeah. Okay. I'm just checking and making we sure. We're going to taste it. All right. So there she is. She's got the little, got the little holes. We're just going to set it to the side there. And um, I'm going to mix this up real quick. Now, you just need um, one and a half cups of milk. Boom, boom, with this little jello. 
Oh, I did do too much. I'm gonna pour back in. It's clean. Things are too expensive to waste. That's right. We, we ain't trying out. to do all that. Uh -uh. No, honey, no. So now you can use the vanilla instant vanilla pudding if you want to. Um, I'm gonna do cheesecake because I am gonna have a cream cheese uh, little frosting on top, y'all. It is delicious. Now you don't even have to do the um, the little icing. I'm gonna show you on top. You can just top it with Cool Whip, honey, and that is that is good, good, good too. So it can be really quick. You can use the pie filling and the Cool Whip and um, this little instant pudding, and you got yourself a good cake. All right, we'll mix it up. All right, poor little baby. She sounds like she's on her last leg. I'm telling you. All right, while this is warm and while this is a uh, this is um, still loosey goosey. <laughs> We're gonna just pour this right on top, just like this. You see it going in the holes, Russell. Look at that. Oh yeah. All that little goodness that's going in them holes, honey. Mmm. There's some goodness right there. That blueberry on top. Man, what? All that goodness. Turn it. Give everybody some love there. All right, now this is gonna go in the fridge for about 10 minutes. Y'all, this is gonna be so good and so moist. Look there, it already looks good. Looks like I can just eat a piece right now. It does. It looks delicious, just like that. Yes, it does. There's a little, little fell over here done got no love. All right. 10 minutes in the fridge, and um, I'm gonna whip up that icing while I am letting this uh, chill. All right, y'all, the cream cheese icing. I've got one block of cream cheese, and I'm just gonna uh, whip the daylights out of it. Just beat it until it's nice and creamy. I should've did this first, I'm telling you. I'm trying to open these things. Law, it just, uh, Kicks my butt sometimes. I don't know about y'all, but I find that the off brand is the ones that are uh, the struggle. The Philadelphia, it just comes right out. So you know when um, I'm struggling, <laughs> I ain't got the off brand. All right, we getting it all though. I ain't playing around with it now. All right, so I'm just gonna whip this till it's really creamy. All right, she's creamy, all mixed in. Now, I'm going to um, add me some heavy whipping cream and a cup of powdered sugar. So, I'm gonna, about a cup and uh, three quarters of heavy whipping cream. And I'm of course gonna add me a little vanilla. All right. See where that gets us. <laughs> now, back to whipping it. All right, see how it's looking now? It's all creamy, creamy. creamy. creamy, creamy. Still see just a little bit of lumps in there, but it's gonna be all right because that powdered sugar is gonna take good care of it. I'm gonna go ahead and put um, a cap full of this uh, good old vanilla extract. Now, Get every drop of that cream. I'm gonna just wipe this out and use the same thing. Try not to make a huge mess. Russ don't like washing dishes. No, not a fan. <laughs> uh, I don't like washing no, dishes. I don't believe nobody likes washing dishes. That's uh, not something that you really like. All right, a cup of uh, just 10 eggs sugar, some powdered sugar. Here we go. I'm holding this real still because it's about to drop. All right. Now we're going to give this a little mix up and that's all it is. All right, y'all. It is nice and thick. It's going to be delicious. Now, this cake has many variations. I was talking to my mama this morning on the phone. 
And um, she said she just uses some uh, Cool Whip, a tub of Cool Whip mixed with um, a couple tablespoons of sour cream. And she says that's how she's always done it. It is good. But um, this is going to give it that little bit of cheesecake flair. And um, see how nice and thick it is? Just turned out wonderful. So, I'm going to clean up my mess. And um, by then, my cake should be cool and we're going to start putting it together. All right, y'all. This is all that's left. Look at this. Nice and cool. Um, that fridge gives it uh, just enough time to let that pudding in there sit. Then, of course, we got this yummy icing. So, I'm going to take my little blueberry mix and uh, just put it on top of here. Just kind of roll it around a little bit. Yummy, yummy. Good stuff. Give it some love. Mm -hmm. Yum. You excited? I'm excited. Ready to try I'm this ready. poke cake? I'm ready to taste it. <sighs> this is, um, poke cakes are good. With, I mean, there are so many good poke cakes out there. But um, we had these blueberries and... I'm gonna take one for the team out there. I'll oh, take one for the team. Yeah. The blueberry got away. I have to taste it for y'all. Yeah. He's really suffering. Gotta take yeah. one for the team. Yeah. <laughs> uh, and it's my birthday today. It is, and she's up in here in the and kitchen. And I'm up in the kitchen, y'all. Should I say happy birthday to y'all? No, I don't want. No, y'all turn off. Y'all will I definitely think you turn off. Y'all dogs will start barking and. I think you should. No, we don't need none of that today. Oh, you the one that sings, you the singer. I'm no. not the singer of the two of us. You don't sing to yourself. Happy birthday. No, you got some happy birthday wishes. Today. I have gotten so much birthday love today, y'all. I am telling you what. I um, am just overwhelmed with yeah. all the love. All right, there's the blueberries on top. Now, nothing but... Nothing left but this goodness. Look at that. Whew. Like I said, if you don't want to mix this up and have this cream cheese flavor, I wanted to have like a, a cheesecake kind of a flavor going on. So that's why I did it this way. But um, you can feel free to do it with just Cool Whip. If you want to add the sour cream or just Cool Whip, it's good. All right, let's get this all, all this goodness off of here. Look at that, yeah. good. Well, just give a little, little spread around there. Yummy. Man, I'm telling y'all what, I can't wait. He can't that. wait. Mm. The house smells good. Yeah. Smell it mm. real good. I believe this is going to be a hit. I hope you like it. Yeah. I've made poke cakes before. He just don't remember it. I ain't never heard no hotter, yeah. hotter hair in no poke cake. He, um, he just don't remember it. Mm. It's kind of funny now that you're in here with the kid in the kitchen with me and you're seeing all these things you didn't realize happened behind the scenes. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you I'm learning. That. I'm like a student. He is. Yeah. We'll be watching something. He's like, hey, you ain't supposed to do that, are you? No. You have really been watching good. Well, you pick up on stuff while you're He's been you doing it, y'all. I'm telling you. Don't worry, y'all. There's not going to be no Russell's Country Kitchen oh, coming anytime soon. Oh, come on, man. <laughs> that ain't going to happen. Come on, man. Nah. You're getting pretty handy on the grilling. Yeah. Been cooking me supper, just doing all kind of good stuff. I enjoy that grill, y'all. All right, y'all. There's a little bit of blueberry shining through, but it's going to be just all it right. It's delicious. It looks fantastic. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Mm -hmm. All right, you ready for this uh, this taste? I can't wait. All right, I'm gonna slice you a piece. Let's see what it looks like in the middle. Yeah. All right, y'all, it's that time. It is time to taste this good old cake. Come on, Russell. He's um, gonna jog in here. He's ready for it. Hey, y'all. Cut it short and sweet. Short and sweet, baby. Yeah, I'm ready. He's ready for oh, it. This looks delicious. Can't say that I've ever heard of no poke cake, but we about to see what that's all about. I'm sure I've had something similar. I know I know she made like a code red. 
Yeah, code red. Code where you pour stuff red. in it. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, I, I don't know if that's what that is, but. Some code red Mountain Dew. Boy, let me tell you. <laughs> it's good stuff, ain't it, boo boo? Oh, my goodness, y'all. Let me tell you how good that is. I'm tempted just to hide it. When I'm the only <laughs> one, Summer just have to get over it tomorrow. Well, sorry, baby. Yeah. She won't yeah. see it until after she's back uh, home. Well, yeah, well, she might see it, y'all. She's going to see it. Anyway, she's coming three hours. She'll definitely We got a time. whole cake. We got plenty. It's going to be just fine. Yep. My mama made us promise her piece, so that's yep. going to happen. She's going to get a little piece of it. Mm -hmm. That icing is delicious. Good. It, is. it goes really well together, y'all. Blueberries are sweet. Pudding in the middle. I mean, it's good. That's the really good. Really, it makes it really. It's really, really pairs nice really, really, really well. It does. I it's, could eat the whole piece right here on camera, y'all. And I'll be at um, a lemon cake, a lemon cake mix. Mm -hmm. In fact, I've done it with a lemon cake mix, and it is really good. Um, just added flavor, but you can use whatever whatever cake mix you want, whatever kind of fruit you want. You can do strawberry. You can do whatever you want. It's um. Strawberry would, good, would yeah, be good too. Strawberries yeah. is good. Uh, cherry pie filling. Kind of like your cherry yum yum oh, he yeah. loves. Yeah, I love that stuff. But That's um, good. it's good, y'all. It's got a good cream cheese, like a creamy, like a cheesecake mm -hmm. taste to it. It's very good. Very good. It Give is. it a try, y'all. Y'all yes. like this one. And um, it's uh, fairly easy to throw together. Don't let the ingredients um scare you off because it's just two or three things mixing at one time Didn't seem it's like it was really yeah it's, it's not hard at all and it's something you can put in the refrigerator the day before um cook it the day before or whatever and just um keep it in there and this is even going to get better the colder it gets we can put it in the refrigerator and it's going to sit there and it's just going to get better yeah it's going to get better with age, just like me. <laughs> no. Y'all, happy birthday to my beautiful bride. <laughs> She's uh, once again a year older than me. Oh, so, uh, don't remind yeah, me. Yeah, yeah. You know how... Uh, She's only three months old. I'm three months old, I always he? say, now, how old are you today? And I'll say, well, how old am I? And I'm like, well, okay, what's that minus... What's, <laughs> 52 wrong. minus 51. She definitely don't look it. I'll just say that. Oh. I am 52 today, so um, I'm, you know, going You're down. You're doing okay for 52. Just, uh, <laughs> Don't, going down the other side. In my man. biased view, you do, well, you do all right. Well, thank you, baby. Thank yep. you, thank yep. you. But anyway, y'all, I hope you try this. Yeah, give and, it a try. Um, yeah, if you do, let me know. Let, let us know how you like it. We thank y'all so much for um, all my new people. Just a big old hug to y'all. Yeah. Um, and, of course, all... My people that have um, followed Since faithfully, the yeah, faithfully. We appreciate every one of y'all. Big, really big hugs and love yep. to y'all. So, y'all, until next time.